Uh, Senator Heinrich, you mentioned that you don't think this proposal to streamline NEPA is going to go through anytime soon. But you two have actually worked together on some bipartisan energy policy back in 2015. Um, you're part of a group of senators that uh, came up with a compromise between Republicans and Democrats where uh, the United States lifted its ban on oil exports in exchange for the renewal of renewable energy tax credits that were due to expire. So I wanted to ask, for this Congress, is there any chance of any kind of bipartisan legislation on energy? You know, we've produced, our committee has, it works pretty well. Um, the question, I think, will be once again whether we can get the energy package that has already passed the Senate and with large numbers from both parties. Um, we voted, the, which we supported in more than one Congress. Yeah, that's <laughs> right. Yeah. What does it take to get the House to, um, to pass this bill? This is this bipartisan energy bill that's been out there for four years now. I, you know, it's the world of the doable, right? Like this is something we can get done or we can, you know, have both sides wait for the perfect somewhere down the road. I think what 2015 really represented is we, we looked at where we could compromise, how we could create some certainty and didn't let, you know, dogma get in our way. I think we'll get it. Um, and Martin and I have worked on other stuff, um, Indian Affairs. We, there's a variety of things he and I have worked together on, and some we've passed and some we haven't. Sometimes you just got to keep working it. I think we'll get there on the energy bill, and we have other bipartisan energy legislation that will move. Um, you know, we all have some different ideas in this area, but, but the idea of trying to drive the investment and the technology forward in terms of the energy world, both to get more energy and better environmental stewardship, we agree on that as a baseline. And some of the hows in terms of you know, what we do, we differ on. So I think he's right. Our energy committee works in a pretty bipartisan way on most issues, and I think we'll continue to advance legislation in this Congress.